Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. We are back with more. Small land. Survive the wilds. And our adventure this time is to get Flint. Now, Flint, <laughs> one of my many gravestones is not over here. Over here is Bark. Flint is down in this area. We are right here. So I came down this area. So my, where, from where my base is, I came down. You can see this major arch here. You just work your way down, following the trees, and dodging yellow jackets like a mofo. But now that I'm here, I built a workbench so I can repair anything that needs to be repaired and make arrows or anything else. Got into a fight with some yellow jackets, ran back in here, Kind of beat my base up, but I killed him. And I survived it. Three of them, so... Wasn't too bad. Why do I have an extra wooden sword? That is a good question. Grasshopper treat. I might use at some point. They were pretty low on our supplies for that, though. Which I'm not a fan of. But... It's all good. So, currently... More poppies. We were talking about poppies in the last one to get the nectar. Lots here. Problem is, there's yellow jackets. So what do you do? You avoid them wherever you can. That's what we're going to do. They really can't take them on in a stand-up fight. Same time, I... Yeah, I was wondering if there's anything on like that over here. Okay. So we'll just need wood. Um, all through here. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, shit. So the other reason to put this so close is if we die on the way down. I, uh, I don't want to have to worry about that. You know what I mean? We'll just respawn and we'll go run back and get our guy. You guys are awfully close to the ground here. So the question is, can I kill this one? I'm not sure how their stuff works. Um, well, that's a giant. Oh, we got to survive that full, and there's more damn yellow jackets. I'm not seeing the flint anymore. Makes me wonder if we got to go further to the right. You know what? I guess we're not going to let these little suckers get in our way. Now, we do want to collect all the bee parts that we can. Because we're going to need them for a flying suit later. Oh, 
Okay. I've killed those green ones before. They're not that bad. Sorry if I'm being very quiet. These things just make me nervous. That's bark, and that is not what we need. another kind of bug over there. Oh shit. Water bug. I should be able to kill water bug pretty easy. Well, you didn't even have anything good. Wait a minute. Roach meat. Oh, that's new. Just keep running, you little punk. Okay. Really? Well, we can. Oh! Out of nowhere. I think this is probably a good spot. Make another little base. Let's see. 
All right, so we're going again. Just trying to see if we can get... God, that's what it is right there, too. It's Flint. That's what we're looking for. Question, what's going to be protecting it, though? Because it is like the next major upgrade. And we need a lot of it. Oh. I didn't see what they got. Okay. We'll go back to our base and we'll go down and get it. I am curious what's on top up there. All right, so we got another little base here. I ran out of stuff, though. We shouldn't be freezing in here. Yeah, how about that to fix the dam? Can make anything? Oh, we can. What is the, the jerky? Uh, it's the same as everybody else. All right, so just hold on a second here. Once this passes, we'll be good. Yeah, I'm gonna have to fight this asshole. No, I'm not. Oh, this better not all be bark, man. You gotta be kidding me. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Shit. All right, let's see what we get per flint thing. That's it? Wow. Ooh, okay, that sucks. The really depressing part is going to have to be making it back to our base. The main base, because that's where all our gear is to build things. How many can you get in a stack? Only 30? Let's see, uh, getting a 60 at least. 
And part of that sucks is to get bark. Um, you have to have the pickaxe made with flint. So. Oh. But hold on here. I'm going to get as much of this as I can before it gets dark. I do not want to know what comes out down here at night. Alrighty, folks. This is the bridge that I'm talking about. Where I'm standing right now, you'll be able to tell it's covered in a mushrooms. Great spot to get a bunch of chow, which I'm going to do. I'm going to grab a bunch of things here, so I don't have to worry about food. But it appears the grasshopper scythe works real well against bumblebees. But hold on a second here. We'll go back. We'll see what kind of stuff that we can make. And then we'll start thinking about where we're going next. Because I think I know. I think it's time for us to try and find um, the stuff we need to get our bee suit. Why bee suit? Because then we can fly. But yeah, you just got to use these little mushrooms to get up. And then it's just the same stuff that was over here before that we got to get around. These two guys. Okay, what are sh flint shears? Flint blades join together to make an effective and durable cutting tool used to cut spider cocoons open. Ugh. Oh, I need bark for that. Flint pickaxe. Flint uh, stone, a uh, sword. Definitely want that. I'm not convinced about the uh, the spears. I've already, um, I was already using one. Yeah, I made the stone spear, and I was like really under impressed with it. Oh, yeah, we definitely need that. Okay, so let's see. Let's go here. Oh, there's a grasshopper leg. Take that with us, though. Okay, I just needed to do that. There we go. All right. So. Got a bunch. Ooh. Got ch chitin. Herptile hind. I wonder how harvest damage edge six nine versus four six. 500, so it should last twice as long. That's the one. Ah, more refined wood. Well, you know, good thing I've got plenty of this stuff. All right. And we got our amount of bar. It's 350 versus... 400, 811 pierce damage versus 46. Not a room, run out of places to put stuff. Okay, so the other thing. 
well actually not the other thing we need to look and see what we can now build okay so we need bark for that cannery we just need more refined wood I can do that oh, oh we just got something else we can make what popped up loom and spindle silk well silk's gonna come from spiders and we're a long ways from taking those things on yet because we need to get the apothecary so that means we need to go back to where we were and get bark now that we have the appropriate uh, It's not that bad, though. Now that I know what I know. What can we make in here? Herp leather. Okay, well, I gotta go grab my leather now. Jeez. Actually. Whoa. We should try that out. Give me my herpes leather. What do we turn into? Okay. Well, <laughs> we know killing the geckos gives us that. one oh the other thing I was gonna see is what can we make with the cauldron black bear jam 360 seconds of nourishment and it's a 50 oh yes oh I only got three out of it that's okay though I need to get a crap ton of that bark. Jeez, I'm down to only five. Okay, so. I need to make another trip down there to the coast, to where we were. Once we do that, we can get um, bark. And then we can make the loom. And then we got a couple of things to do. So from our spawn point, maybe we'll just start from here, go down and get Bark in the next episode, and then go over here to Scotty, because he is going to have, um, I think he has his spider silk stuff, right? Or he gives us the ability for it. There's spiders in that area, but over here, there's a swamp, and where there's a swamp, there's lots of spiders. So, tune in next time, and keep your heads down, your warriors of doom. And I'll see you again real damn soon.